we are back at the York Downs Golf Course today for the rematch. As you know, last time Andy beat me, but today we're looking to change that. All right, Andy's got the driver out. As you can see, this big tree on the right, so he's trying to gonna keep it left. Hopefully he had a draw around that tree. Alright, we've made it to Andy's ball. He's gotta hit a hook off the tee, so he's got a tough shot here. He's probably just gonna punch out, I'm guessing. Thick rough. He's kinda gonna try and go through this gap right here and hit a little fade. And hopefully what club you got? He's got a seven. Oh, looks like he got lucky. I think he got through that tree. Should be good up there, we'll see. All right, so we came up to my ball. It looks like it hit this big tree behind me and um, just kind of dropped down. So I'm just gonna try and get it on the green. Yeah. This shot. All right, so that worked out great for Andy. He got it up through everything, so he's got a nice chip here for par, I think. Should be really good. Oh, it almost went in. Nice shot. Here's my putt for birdie. Got about. All right, here's Andy's uh, bogey putt. Already won the match, but or, uh, the hole, he's just gonna putt it out though. Oh, he drains it, nice putt. So we're on the, this will just be the second hole of the match. It's par four, dog leg left. I hit it in the trees last time, so I'm gonna try not to do that again, but we'll just tee off and hope for the best. All right, I got the driver out. Trying to keep it left this time instead of going to trees, so. Really Alright, Andy's got the driver. He's gonna try and do the exact same thing he did last time, which was just fade it over these bunkers. Played a baby draw. Should be good if it sits. Alright, so here's where Andy ended up. As you can see, there's a cart path there. Looks like he hit that and it just flew onto the next hole. So he's gonna try and go over these trees and just land it on the green. He's got a pitching wedge. All right, Andy with the P wedge over the trees. Here we go. Oh, I just chunked it. All right, so here's what I'm looking at. I probably got a P wedge. It's like lots of left to right wind. All right, here's what Andy's looking at. He's just gonna try and take it over this little pine tree here, so. Oh, that could be really good. Yep, he's putting. Nice shot. I'd hit it like perfectly pin high. Hold in there, so I'm gonna try and Alright, here's Andy's par putt, just on the fringe. Looks like it goes right to left. Oh, that's like a double breaker, actually. Whoa. <laughs> so these greens 
are like really outgrown. It's like the length of a fringe. So I think you just tried to hammer it, but a little too much on that one. All right, here's this puck coming back. Good speed, just a little left. All right, so here's my puck for birdie. I'm just gonna try and tap in. All right, so we just finished up that hole. I had a par, I think. No, no, bogey, I had a bogey. And Andy had a double, unfortunately. So I'm two up in the match now. We're going into this par three here. And I think his goal is kind of just, hopefully he can win the next two and send it to a playoff hole. Is hopefully what happens for him, but I'm gonna try and hold him off and keep the lead. Here's the par three, bunker on the left, bunker on the right. The pin's on, kind of tucked in the back right, so I'm gonna try and put it close. Get a kick. Oh, it's just short. Still have a good chip though. Good chance for par. Alright, I got a nine iron guys. Oh, that's gonna be good. That's really good. Alright guys, here's where I ended up. I got like 15 feet maybe. And he's just short there. He had a good line, but just didn't swing hard enough. Use his chip for a birdie. Oh, very nice. Sit right there. Great shot. Here's my birdie putt. Got about 15 feet. That was terrible. All right, here's both our par putts. And he needs me to miss this. So, uh, see what happens. All right, here's Andy's putt to win this hole. I actually missed that putt, which is very unfortunate. All right, so we got a par five. Bunker on the left there shouldn't be an issue. It's pretty easy to carry. And lots of downwind, so this could be a big drive. Andy with the drive. Oh, I just pulled it. It should be okay over there. It's kind of where I was last time where I was just able to hit it over the trees. I got the driver. Alright, we found Eddie's ball. He doesn't really have much of a shot. There's lots of trees. He's just gonna kind of punch this gap straight ahead. Oh, I think he just topped it. Alright, I'm in a kind of similar spot as Andy. I just have a six iron. I'm gonna just try and punch through this gap here. Alright, here's Andy. He's kind of just do the same thing as he did last shot. Alright, he's back on the fairway. Alright, here's Andy. He's got a 9 iron. He's got to put this close if he wants to uh, stay in this match. He's got about 165, 160. Oh, really nice shot. If it goes, that could be good. Wow, great shot. I think he's just off the back on the fringe, but. Guys, I got like. All right, walking up to the green, here's Andy's shot. It's actually not the greatest fly, I got kind of unlucky there. Here's the pin. I'm just left, which perfectly too high, so I'm happy with that. 
So I got that for Bernie. He's got that for Par. So he's got to make this, and I got a two putt for him to send it to um, an overtime. Let's see if we can chip in. Oh, I just left it short. Oh, that's sick! Alright, here's Andy for. Here's Andy for both. Alright, Andy, what were your thoughts on the match here? Well, today I didn't play that great. Uh, last time I played way better. So uh, hopefully we can improve next time. Alright, guys, I just made that massive birdie putt and won the match. So I'm pretty happy with that. Andy did not have his best day, but. I mean, we're one to one in these matches, so we might have to film one more.